care for a drink? Oh yes, thank you. I'll have a bloody mix. Hop on the bus because we're setting off on an exciting journey through the world of this classic show. While David and Shirley take the vocal spotlight, I've got a plethora of captivating tales to share, ranging from the bizarre to the sultry. Although the series may have projected a wholesome image, the behind-the-scenes reality was filled with unexpected twists and turns. Actors contended with both personal struggles and industry pressures that cast shadows over their fame. The challenges of on-screen chemistry sometimes collided with real-life tensions, leaving us to wonder what truly happened out of the public eye. The pursuit of stardom brought about intense rivalries, heartfelt friendships, and moments that blurred the lines between scripted and spontaneous. This juggling act of fame often reveals how hard it can be to maintain a polished front. Join me as we explore astonishing secrets that might surprise even the biggest fans of this beloved show. Inspired by the real-life musical group, the Cowsills, the Partridge family shared similarities like familial makeup and the absence of a father. Though the Cowsills never appeared in the show, producers insisted on having Shirley Jones portray the family matriarch. The Partridge family became known for its catchy tunes and heartwarming family dynamics, captivating audiences with its music and wholesome storytelling. Shirley Jones's role as the loving and talented mother of the musical Partridge siblings resonated with viewers, making the show a beloved classic of its time. If they do, I'll run their shorts up the flagpole. <laughs> the Partridge family shared a home with another popular primetime family, the Kravitzes, who lived next door to the witch Samantha Stevens in Bewitched. The houses of these two shows were used interchangeably in various productions. It's worth a try, isn't it? Let's face it, it's either a picnic or let Reuben try again. Need we say more? Shirley Jones, who played the head of the Partridge family, was offered the role of the mother in the Brady Bunch, but turned it down because she didn't want to be typecast as a mother taking the roast out of the oven and not doing much else. The matriarch of the show, Shirley Jones, had a wild personal life, including quickies across the street from the set with her husband and group encounters with other people. She and her husband were known for their insatiable appetites and rock and roll lifestyle. Because your work is below par. Honey, tell me honestly, how well are you really doing in that time? In the 1970 TV series The Partridge Family, Danny Bonaduce, who played Danny Partridge, took his role as the troublemaker too seriously and often forgot his lines, leading to tensions on set. His castmates eventually reached their limit and had to take disciplinary action. Despite the challenges, the show continued to be a fan favorite, captivating audiences with its blend of music, humor, and family dynamics. Danny's portrayal of the mischievous character added a layer of authenticity to the dynamics within the Partridge family, albeit causing some behind-the-scenes difficulties. The interactions and conflicts among the cast members mirrored the on-screen chemistry, making the show's narrative even more compelling. Despite Danny's struggles with his character, his dedication to the role ultimately contributed to the show's lasting legacy as a beloved classic. The Partridge family remains a significant piece of television history, known for its iconic music and memorable characters that continue to resonate with audiences today. That's you, I can build a wall, I can fool myself. In the 1970s, David Cassidy, who played Keith Partridge, captured the hearts of many fans. His role in the show made him a significant teen idol, adored for his charm and musical talent. As part of a fictional family band, he showcased his singing abilities while charming viewers with his good looks and charisma. However, despite his immense popularity, Cassidy faced a significant financial setback. His contract did not include provisions for royalties for merchandise featuring his image. This oversight meant that he missed out on a substantial amount of potential earnings. Products like posters, dolls, and clothing capitalize on his likeness, generating considerable income for the producers. While he enjoyed fame and recognition, the lack of royalties became a critical issue as he reflected on his career. Many fans remember him fondly, but it's essential to acknowledge the challenges he faced in navigating the entertainment industry during that era. The impact of this classic remains strong, illustrating both the joys and pitfalls of stardom in that time. Saying goodbye and thank you again for a very very nice evening. I hope you'll come back whenever you can. Susan Day, known for her role as Lori Partridge on The Partridge Family, harbored feelings for co-star David Cassidy, who portrayed Keith Partridge, 
However, David only viewed Susan as a friend despite her affections. Shirley Jones, who played the mother, intervened in hopes of sparking a romance between them. Unfortunately, their relationship didn't endure, leading to discord between Susan Day and David Cassidy, altering the dynamics on the set of the show. Free from the fear and destruction of man. The Partridge family featured several notable guest stars, such as Rob Rayner, Richard Pryor, and Ray Bolger. Seeing an opportunity to take the Partridges on extraordinary adventures, producers developed the animated series Partridge Family 200 D, where the family ventured into space. Despite its unique premise, the show was short-lived, leaving fans wanting more of this classic family's cosmic escapades. Okay, who booked us to perform? The show brought a fresh take on family life in the 1970s, combining humor with music, and it resonated with many viewers. Featuring a family that traveled and performed together, it highlighted themes of togetherness and support. The catchy songs, such as I Think I Love You, became popular and contributed to the show's charm. It also introduced diverse storylines, including topics like teenage issues, relationships, and the challenges of single parenting, making it relatable for a wide audience. This classic has left a lasting legacy in television history. It paved the way for other family-oriented shows, influencing how families were portrayed on screen. The blend of comedy and music became a template for future series, showing that family entertainment could appeal to both children and adults. Today, the show remains relevant because of its universal themes of love and acceptance. It is often referenced in pop culture and continues to be enjoyed by new generations on streaming platforms. Its message about family bonds and navigating life's challenges still resonates, making it timeless. Out after the concert tonight. Oh, Keith! <laughs> in assembling the cast for the Partridge family in 1970, key actors were chosen through rigorous auditions and chemistry tests. David Cassidy, who played Keith Partridge, impressed producers with his musical talent and charisma. Shirley Jones, as the mother, brought her extensive acting experience to the role. Susan Day won the part of Laurie Partridge after a standout audition, while Danny Bonaduce's spunky personality landed him the role of Danny Partridge. Jeremy Gelbwax initially played Chris Partridge, but was later replaced by Brian Forster for a better fit. These pivotal moments defined the casting and led to the iconic ensemble that charmed audiences for years. Who's the second part about? Well, it's about someone who I deeply... The director of the Partridge family approached the series with a vision that celebrated family dynamics and the joys of music. Influenced by the vibrant pop culture of the 1970s, the director aimed to create a light-hearted yet relatable show that captured the essence of a modern American family. The use of bright colors, catchy songs, and humorous situations reflected the optimistic spirit of the era. Collaboration with the cast was key. The director encouraged improvisation, allowing actors to bring their personalities into their roles. This approach not only enhanced authenticity, but also fostered a strong camaraderie among the cast members. The balance between scripted dialogue and spontaneous interactions made the family feel genuine and engaging. Additionally, the director worked closely with the crew to ensure that each episode showcased lively musical performances that were both entertaining and integral to the storyline. This collaborative, and creative environment contributed significantly to the show's lasting appeal and cultural significance in television history. Thought, so what? So, right on the lips, right in the middle. Set in the vibrant world of a musical family, the production of the Partridge family brought unique challenges and creative solutions. The show was filmed primarily on the Metro Goldwyn Mayer lot in California, where a cheerful set was designed to reflect the warm, inviting atmosphere of a family home. The living room featured bright colors and eclectic furniture, creating a cozy yet lively space where the partridges interacted. Filming on location was another essential aspect, particularly for scenes involving the family's bus, a brightly painted vehicle that became a symbol of the show. The production team often had to secure permits to film in public areas, adding logistical complexity. Transporting the cast and crew between various locations required precise timing and coordination, especially with the family's musical performances. Innovative filming techniques, such as multi-camera setups, allowed for dynamic shots during musical numbers. This method captured the energy of live performances and made audiences feel part of the action. 
The use of synchronized sound recording was also notable, enabling clear audio during the lively scenes, a technological advancement that enhanced the show's musical elements. The challenges of managing a young cast and adhering to a strict filming schedule were met with creative scheduling, ensuring that school was prioritized for child actors. This balance between education and entertainment became a hallmark of the series, making it relatable to its audience. The Partridge family not only entertained, but also showcased the ingenuity of its production team in bringing to life a memorable and beloved television series. I saw all the sites. One I especially liked. What was the name of that place? Muldoon's Point? That's the place. The musical score and soundtrack of the 1970 TV series The Partridge Family were vital in enhancing the narrative and emotional tone of the show. Composers Wes Farrell and Danny Jansen created catchy, upbeat tunes that match the family-friendly, light-hearted nature of the series. The iconic theme song, Come On Get Happy, became a hit and set the cheerful tone for the show. The musicians involved, including actors David Cassidy and Shirley Jones, lent their vocals to many of the tracks, adding a personal touch to the music. Overall, the music of the Partridge family added depth and charm to the on-screen adventures of the musical family band, making it a memorable part of the show's success. Just don't remember. Mom, how could I have forgotten something like that? Is it really that important? My whole mouth was already... The Partridge Family, a popular 1970 TV series, featured several iconic scenes that left a lasting impact on the audience. One standout moment was the family's musical performances, showcasing their talent and bond on screen. The direction in these scenes highlighted the energy and harmony among the cast members, drawing viewers into the music and story. Additionally, emotional scenes where the family dealt with challenges were portrayed with depth and authenticity by the talented actors. Their performances brought out the heartfelt moments and struggles faced by the characters, resonating with the audience on a personal level. Cinematography played a crucial role in capturing the essence of the era, with vibrant colors and dynamic camera angles adding to the overall nostalgic feel of the show. The visual elements enhanced the storytelling, creating a sense of connection between the viewers and the characters. Filmmakers and actors involved in the Partridge family have shared insights on these iconic scenes, expressing pride in the impact they had on audiences. Their commentary reflects the dedication and creativity that went into crafting memorable moments that have stood the test of time. Lies, we may be stuck here four or five days. Mom only brought enough food for two. The Partridge Family, a popular 1970 TV series, had a significant cultural and social impact. It resonated with audiences through its portrayal of a musical family band, blending music and comedy. The show influenced pop culture by launching successful music albums and establishing teen heartthrobs. It contributed to discussions on family dynamics and the changing social norms of the time, touching on themes of youth counterculture and generational conflicts. The show's upbeat tone and catchy music brought families together, making it a memorable part of 1970s television history. I'd like to say goodbye. I'll go get it. I, I looked into a room on the way down. Let her sleep. Goodbye. The Partridge family received a warm critical reception during its run from 1970 to 1974. Critics often praised the show's blend of music, humor, and family dynamics. Reviews highlighted the catchy tunes performed by the fictional Partridge family, led by Shirley Jones and featuring her real-life stepson, David Cassidy. Audiences connected with the storylines that explored relatable themes, making it a household favorite. Viewers appreciated the light-hearted approach to family life, which resonated during a time of social change in America. The show garnered several nominations and awards, including Golden Globe nominations for Best TV Show and Best Actress in a Television Series for Shirley Jones. The popularity of the series also led to chart-topping albums, indicating its cultural impact beyond television. These accolades signified recognition for the cast talent and the show's innovative take on family entertainment. For those involved, such honors validated their hard work and creativity, solidifying their place in television history. You'll get used to it. Time is a great healer. Bernie. Behind the scenes of the Partridge family, there were many fun moments. David Cassidy, who played Keith Partridge, was a talented musician in real life, just like his character. The cast members often sang and played music together between takes. Susan Day, who portrayed Lori Partridge, had a pet squirrel that she would bring to the set. The crew members loved watching the squirrel run around and play. 
Danny Bonaduce, who played Danny Partridge, was known for his mischievous pranks on set. Despite his antics, he had a great camaraderie with the rest of the cast. The show's colorful wardrobe was a hit with viewers, but behind the scenes, it sometimes caused issues. The cast would frequently joke about the wild outfits they had to wear. Despite the challenges of filming a TV series, the cast and crew of the Partridge family shared a special bond that shone through on screen. Oh, I thought, but if you're busy, I can just forget it. If you're asking for a ride, it's fine with me. The Partridge Family, a 1970 TV series, holds a significant place in film history, influencing future filmmaking with its innovative approach. The show's unique blend of comedy and music paved the way for other family-oriented programs to explore similar themes, impacting the storytelling landscape for years to come. Its portrayal of a single mother leading a musical family band resonated with audiences and inspired various spin-offs and adaptations in the entertainment industry. The Partridge family's legacy lies in its ability to capture the essence of family dynamics and music, leaving a lasting imprint on pop culture. I certainly wouldn't want to make you nervous. Reflecting on the timeless charm of the Partridge family, we invite you to share your personal connections with this beloved 1970s TV series. Delve into cherished memories or the lasting impact it had on your cinematic perspective. Your stories bring the era of the Partridge family to life, resonating with audiences near and far. Engage with us through likes, shares, and subscriptions to delve deeper into cinematic explorations together. The dog or something, it was sad, so I punched him. <laughs> you start breakfast.